my creek B and here's the warehouse. I'm going to show you around a little bit so that you can kind of get an idea of what uh, we have here in the facilities. Alright, so this is the front of the building. We actually have two garages. So this front door, that garage, and then this garage and the other door too are part of the space. 9,000 square feet. And it's kind of windy right now, but I'll give you kind of a mano here. There's an open lot here in the front. I'm not sure what they're doing, they just emptied that. And that one's over there. It's an empty empty lot day. Nobody's working. We got a that's our dumpster. Pick that up once a week or whenever you want. Come into the office. We have post office usually picking up in this area. Computer. If we've had people before greeting. Uh, we've had pickup orders and other things, but I don't have as much need for that anymore. Most people just have everything shipped. This is the break room. And it could be an office, could be anything you want it to be. This is where Andrea is usually sh shipping and, and working. And then it's a little messy, just so you know, after the holidays. Working hard to get all the orders out before we had a long weekend and break. So I don't blame them, but this is as messy as it gets. Um, but this is our picking stations. Everybody brings back the product and boxes it up and puts our packing slips in here. You can see some orders they were working on there. Doesn't look like there's very many left that they're working on, but couple stations and then this is our our picking box areas they're for the most part either by category or by alphabetical so got a eucalyptus and bouquet aisle and this is m and y which would be flowers mostly but there's the bathroom and break fridge You'll see use that for oranges and some boxes that need to get broken down, put away. There's pompous grass and some of our, our branches that we pick from. And this is our bouquet station. They make all the custom bouquets and fill up our lavender buds. Uh, go back to the back aisle here a little dark on this aisle I think one of the light bulbs is out most part it's skylighted um, so during the day uh, some of our grasses and just walking down here on the back side of the aisles and Some of the bigger boxes that we have for really big things that we need to ship or whatnot. Um, some shoulder fans and some some uh, like a paper type flowers, palm roses, what we call them. They're made out of palm. Kind of looks like a paper. Some of our more of our extra boxes we pick from and then uh, like solar flowers like the plain and you kind of see in there just uh we got quite an inventory of those and up here too so uh, 12 foot clear ceiling and we have it on two levels 
and then there our heating is just passing by that so we're our pine cones sugar pine cones and then we have corn stalks right there that you can see but yeah we're pretty pick through right now in between christmas and new year's we'll definitely get this place back into into shape a little bit of the dead time when people aren't decorating quite so much this is the far corner of the warehouse and i'll just kind of give you a, there's the forklift and some spare pallets kind of see the each corner there So where most of our shipments come in with our forklift and then we kind of take them around with the with the pallet jack that's that door that's outside we don't use it at all i don't even have a key for it but we just kind of block it off most of the time so and the pallet jack but use the garage door behind the the forklift frequently and we have more bulk storage this side kind of split the warehouse into half and this side is the side that we we use for most of our bulk storage pallets uh, bulk branches just something that we are we're picking through or we're supplying our pick picking area so we grab you know a box or two or you know and take some of the product out of the crates that come up from overseas and and then we'll put it into our picking area most of the time and then yep and we sell tumbleweeds and some of our supply of them there we have a supplier but uh, we also have some of our own just for you know fast overnight shipping because they can't handle that quite as easily but um we do have a this is our the other garage and you can see the product has come in just on the last couple days and they haven't got that quite put away yet so it, this came in from ups but that's the that's the warehouse we're back to the shola and and here's the andrea's computer and and this is our box storage area so you could grab boxes and packing material and put that into everything but it's a good deal for the for the price and it's a it's in a good area